Hey everybody, I'm the Jingle Father, and welcome to Brigador. And if you're wondering what's going on behind me, besides, you know, the game we're about to play, I did change my recording setup. So, uh, just a temporary solution. So, it looks weird. I'm not gonna say that way. Not a big deal. Let's get on to the game. So, Brigador, you guys know Mech Warrior. You know, like, all sorts of mech stuff. You know Pacific Rim? If you know any Gundam... This is, like, the mech genre. This game gets it right, and I have to share this with you guys because my, one of my buddies, Colin, which you'll know from my uh, Forest games, he showed me this game over a stream a little while ago, and I thought it was the coolest thing ever, so I played it, and, um... It's so... As you can see, I'm fat, filthy, rich, actually kind of broke if you look at what some of this stuff costs. Uh... Yeah, you pick your pilot for your mech, and I... Don't know much about the lore, because the lore is, uh, seems like a rabbit hole. We're gonna play someone who's, you know, sorta easy, sorta simple. We're gonna play Merlot Ray. It's only, she's, uh, difficulty 2 instead of 1, because your pilot determines your difficulty, kind of. And then we're gonna, so we're gonna take Merlot instead of Normandy, because I kinda know the game a little bit, not very well, though. We're gonna take the classic vehicle, the classic mech that you start with, the Tor, Turo, Tor, 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 this, that one, the one you see on the screen, that mech. It comes with the Abbott, which is a 105 millimeter high explosive Abbott, which is a cannon. And as you can see, it says, like, down there, that flashing symbol, main, and then next to it, the gray thing that says tour. That's your main gun and your turret. The main gun is, like, I'm assuming that's, like, forward-facing, because you can see on the mech, like, it doesn't turn. It turns with your body. It's not independently turning, like, its own axis. Your secondary gun, though, we're gonna take... I didn't even know I had the Confessor. Oh, this is the auto cannon. We're not gonna take that. We're gonna go with the classic, uh, Medois. My doy, if that's... I don't know how you say that. I don't speak that language. I don't know what that is. This is just like a giant... It's a 12.7 millimeter machine gun. And if any of you guys know weapons, uh, big gun. He comes with a smoke projector, and we're just gonna do it one district. Just to show you guys, uh, what Brigador is really... Oh my god, it's so cool. I fucking... All right. So as you can see, it's this old uh, 90s style isometric deal. Oh, that poor scientist. Oh god. Another one. <clears throat> okay, so immediately, I gotta point some things out to you guys. Left side, upper top. Upper top, top left, whatever. You got your health from the green, you got your shields in the blue. You can get shields, but not health back by killing stuff and blowing some stuff up. You get... Your ammo counter's right next to your little dude porch over here, your smoke indicator up in the top, very left, the yellow thing. Up on the upper right side, I'll get it in the black so you can see it. You've got your main objectives, which are outlined by this, uh, yellow, this, this box, right? The boxes, the rectangles. You gotta destroy four structures on this map. You gotta kill two captains, which are like the regular baddies, but they're kind of beefed up. And you gotta kill 14 Garrison. Garrison is like, oh, Jesus, monkeys. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Just die, there we go. So, so Garrison. Garrison is these, like, dudes that are in the base. It's the security, right? You're here to help. That's what I'm doing. Destroying their shrubbery, I'm helping. Because, I, also, I'm kind of confused by the art style a little bit, because... It seems like it's supposed to be kind of dystopian, but at the same time... Oh my god! Yeah, that was a giant cannon. It seems dystopian, but then you have these really nice... Oh, die, 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 die. Step on you. I'll step on you. Get over here. I'll shoot you, or I'll step on you. One or the other. Shoot, step on... Come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here. Get the hell over here. I'm going to get you. There we go. And see the light blew up in the upper left. That's over shields. Also, my legs are backwards. Hold on. Much better. Yeah, I don't know what kind of vibe or what kind of uh, lore this world has, because it seems like it's almost diesel punk, which is not like cyber... It sounds like cyberpunk, for those of you who probably know what that is. But there's a whole other stuff, like there's solar punk. We're not going to get into that, though. We're here for Brigador. Yeah, look at this! Look at this! There's, like, slums! Look at this! It's insane! I love it! Oh, that's good. That's one of four structures. I feel bad step on the slums. Hold on, let me... I don't feel bad step on you, though. Come here. Well, that's one of the captains! That's what that thing over his head means. It's one of the captains. He's dead now, though. He kind of sucked as a captain. Mm, get him, get him, get him. Yeah. 
They, some of them drop ammo, which is those bullets, the giant freaking bullets you see on the ground. I didn't realize I could destroy the railway tracks, that's awesome. Also, there's a money counter on the upper right, it's red. Breaking stuff gives you money, so, you know, another reason to love this game. I'm sorry, people who live here, but I gotta pull that building up. Oh, yeah. So, the little stuff, the depots, the substations, and the comm towers, upper right again. That is all stuff that you get uh, bonus points, or in this, there's not really points, it's mostly cash. You get bonus cash for doing those objectives. So, as you can imagine, with me being the completionist I am, of course, always don't check my other videos. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do all of those. Also, it's more content for you guys. Die, fool. Yeah, there you go. I feel bad blowing up the slums, man. Like, someone probably... I don't feel bad stuff on you, though. <laughs> I don't... This, this is... I don't know what that says about me as a person, but I love stepping on the little yellow people here. Get them. Mm. Step on the scientist. Yeah! There's another one of those buildings. Hmm. Oh, you can blow up the crops. I didn't even notice they were destructible. Oh, I hate that. Yeah, I'm sorry. No, I say I hate that, but I hate the building. I love the destruction. It's so satisfying. Oh, my God. Blow that up. And it made a hole for me to go through. Perfect. There's like a refugee campsite here. Are these houses like abandoned? Is that what this is? Oh, yeah. You can step on cars and just step on them blows them up. I love that. Yeah, I... I feel like they're being really abundant with the ammo. It wasn't like this last time I played. But yeah, anyway, yeah, I did play this a little bit before. Sorry that you're not getting the initial reaction of Jingle here, but... I couldn't resist it. It was my, it was one of my best buddies, like, recommending a game to me. I had to try it, right? Oh, get your tiny little ass. There you go. That's what you get. You deserve that. Don't deny it. Just like, wow, that is powerful. I forgot how insane the abbot is. That's just... Eh, I could use a little ammo. Yeah, these little things say ammo that I've been blowing up, which I probably shouldn't be doing that all of them. They can give you ammo back, which I just took some cannon rounds from. And I just blew it up again. Because I don't need them to be there forever just to give me ammo. Oh yeah, one other thing. Hitting control centers your view on your mech, or hitting it again lets you extend your uh, view. I like doing this because I like being able to see very far away. And also, that's awesome. Being able to observe like that. Oh, feels like artillery action almost. Oh yeah, speaking of artillery, these are only two of the many, many guns. And there's different classes of guns. Like, you're seeing a turret option and you're seeing a main option. I'm pretty sure there's other crazier stuff, but I could not tell you what it is for the life of me. Oh yeah. That's just... I can't explain this properly. I can't do it justice with words. It is truly, truly satisfying to break shit in this game. Break down those hedges. I don't know how I did- oh wait, I think I broke something. Did I? I, um, I seem to have turned on a grid that I didn't even know could be turned on. One second, let me fix that. I guess that's always been there and I've just been blind? I don't really... I'm just kind of confused now. That's all right. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Let's go. So, we got all the side objectives. We got all the main objectives. Let's get the hell out of here. Man, we got five mil out of that. Look at that. That's sick. That was awesome. I love... Turo? Like, you can't go wrong with Turo. However, I know you're not just here for one little mech. If you're watching this, and I'm gonna make a good mech -y thumbnail for this, probably just the Brigadore art, because it's so dope. There's so many other kinds of vehicles. We're also going to take a more crazy pilot. We're going to take Arturo because he, as you see over here, now it's difficulty 3 for the whole thing, and your payout's higher. But for the vehicle, we're going to take the Blackjack. Because the Blackjack's the last one I used uh, that you guys didn't see. He's, uh, he's got, uh, see, let me read the note. This vehicle, vehicle, the giant mech, because, well, it's technically a vehicle, yeah. This vehicle has additional auto-firing weaponry. And you'll see what those are when we get in. Just wait. Primary, we're going to take the Confessor, which is a 37mm autocannon. For the secondary, we're going to take the Smoothbore Howitzer, the Gutter Ball. Because that sounds fun. Also, we're going to get a new special because I feel like it. Let's get the... Let's get the EMP grenade. That sounds fun. Once well, a small yield EMP war at a low velocity and a high arc. Detonation temporarily disables shielding and drive mechanisms of all vehicles in the blast zone. Anti-grav units are overloaded. 
Wow. Wow. That seems handy versus, like... I don't have much ammo, though. Just be aware of that. We're only gonna do one district, so we can have uh, more, a little... We're not gonna burn out time on this episode. I don't wanna... make too long of one. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a night mission. Okay. I've already got, like, five grand from just walking around breaking shit. Oh, f $5,800. Sorry, I'm gonna break some slumps this time. Oh, one auto cannon shot to just trigger those? Yeah, as you can see, some of the stuff in the environments, like, blow up a bolt. Those were the auto cannons I was talking about. I love those on the blackjack. They're so fun. Let's use that smooth bore. Shit, I missed. Uh, smooth bore. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Smooth bore is insane. I love it. Damn it, die. Damn it, die. Mm, I hate it. I'm... The auto cannon is great, but it doesn't have the fire rate that you need for, like, large crowds. Alright, we're just gonna go head on. Let's go. Whole hog it. Oh my god, that worked. That worked really well. Did not expect that. Holy crap balls. Yeah, those auto cannons are pretty insane. Holy... I don't remember them doing that much damage. Damn, son. Where did you find this? All right. Hey, scientists, run the other way. <laughs> it's just a crowd just smooshed beneath my giant metal feet. I love that shit so much. It's so fun. Smooth bore mortar. Cannon, artillery, howitzer, activate. Really? You survived that? How the hell? Get, get back here. Get back here. There you go. You deserve that. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. That's the ticket. The tickets are right there. Give me the ticket. Damn it. Just... Why won't you die? Die. There we go. See? When you cooperate, you die quicker, I guess? Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Who knows? It's... No one knows. No one can possibly know. <laughs> Alright, we're not even going to bother with the ammo stations this time. We're just going to blow up everything. Because I feel like it. Mm. Oh, that's a problem. Problem, Problems are coming. Problems are here. Problems are in town. Oh, wait. Is that a... Does the EMP... I just shot it out. Does the EMP not affect me? That's sick. Hell yeah. Give me overshields, baby. Overshields galore. I got 450 shields. That's amazing. Walk over the scientists some more. Oh yeah, holding shift lets you do a little squad. I like that. Alright, we're gonna blow him up. ba -boo! Really? You lived or you sit? Fine, another one. And another one. There we go. Alright. Where's the goods? I'm sorry for the mass deforestation of this little tiny wooded area, bud. I got places to get- can I shred these? Oh yeah, I can. Okay, wait. Two houses? Oh! <laughs> oh yeah. Oh shoot. Jeez. God. Look, I hate those. I hate the little dudes. I hate them. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Die, 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 die. Step on him. Yeah. Also, some stuff you're just big enough to walk straight through depending on the size of your mech. Like, this dude can just walk through cars and containers. That's a statue. Wow, I didn't even blow up on the statue. It just went straight through it. Yeah, like, for some reason, these kind of buildings in particular are, like, apparently made of the most brittle plywood you can find. Which is confusing to me, but I'm not going to complain because I like blowing stuff up. I don't want to step on the playground, though. That's, that seems mean. Oh, but my objectives are over here. Oh, that was explosive. Good. Good. Oh, hello. Oh, you fell for it. Mm, you fell for it. You're a sucker. A sucker is what you are, and you're sucking things. I regret everything. Right, let's use that long-range control sauce to figure out a better angle. There we go. Can we hit that? Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can, baby. Mm. Hit the explosive sauce. God, I love it. Howitzer is really satisfying. Holy crap. Look at that, it's just... Look at that, isn't that cool? 
Tell me what you guys think of this, because I think this is the coolest damn thing ever. Alright, right, listen to me. If you guys really want me to play more of this, please let me know, because I totally will. This shit is so cool. Obelisk. Oh, I can tear down a mini Washington Monument. That put me on a watch list just now. Yay! Where's the captain? I thought I could have sworn it said there was a. Yep, there he is. Can I just hit him with the howitzer? Oh my god, that was perfect. I missed with that. That was pitiful, but I'm gonna hit him this time. Yep, and that'll do it. Side objectives complete as well. Let's get the hell out of here. And on the way out, we'll just start blowing up stuff. Like scientists. You know. Because we're just nice like that. God, just the way they explode into chunks. Like, I don't know if it's coming through that clear on the recording, but... It's some meaty chunks they explode into. Oh my god. Five mil again, sick. Yeah, dude. That's Brigador. It's pretty sick. Thank you, Colin, if you're watching this, for showing me this game. It's so fucking cool. God! Everything to do with mechs, honestly, like, if I could do a MechWarrior playthrough and have it be something that people haven't seen before, that'd be sick. Anything to do with mechs. And this game does it so well. There's so much stuff. Like, operations, different kinds of missions. So, so, so many. And this is like, I don't remember how much this was in the Steam store. I'll put a link in the description. It wasn't a lot for what you get. The weapons, the vehicles, the combination. Also, you don't have to just play mechs. Like, there's tanks. There's, like, suits, like, mech, like, little power suits that you run around in, like, power armor if you want to, I think. What's worth 50 million? Oh. That's just a head in a basket? I hate it. And yeah, there's a lot of pilots. I don't know what this guy could possibly be like, because that looks ridiculous. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll probably make another video of this, cause even if no one asked for it, because I just think it's cool. I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya!